very satisfying. Uh, we knew it was going to be a, a tough game and, and we played them, uh, you know, Saturday night at home and, and we had a great game. It was a great crowd at home and uh, we come here and, you know, snowstorm and um, a lot of factors outside of hockey that we, we had to, to deal with. But, um, you know, I think uh, you know, you're seeing a common thing theme here with, with Ned showing up and, and bailing us out. There's some huge breakaway saves and uh, it took us a little bit to get going. And, uh, you know, we challenged the goal and they go up to nothing, but we get one back on the, on the shorty to, to get us going and get the offense going, which was huge. Yeah, absolutely. I thought that was, that was the best third period we played uh, in, a, in a long time. And, and, you know, we rolled lines and, and, you know, offensive zone face-offs, we got our guys out there and, and, we won draws and and we're able to swarm them and and uh, you know we I like the the attitude when we go two two we 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 push for the third one and uh, we got to keep doing that we got to keep playing that way. Uh yeah, <laughs> you know I've talked about it a lot this year the ups and downs and you know, I've really tried to just focus on staying right in the middle and and being there for the guys and and winning hockey games and um, you know, when you do that, you put the team first and, and have that mentality. It, uh, it's amazing what it does for you personally. And, uh, um, you know, I just, uh, just try and show up every night and, and play hard and, and, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's going well right now. You know, obviously it's a huge two points to be able to come back. Um, uh, you know, I, I we, there wasn't a lot being created either way. Um, I was a little bit frustrated with the lack of creation on our end. I thought we had the opportunities to create more and we didn't some of that. We just didn't seem to have it with the puck enough, like in terms of execution. Um, but, you know, we stayed with it. We stayed with it. Obviously, you know, they scored the, the second goal uh, because we didn't have a lot of push. It was a, it was a close call on our end. I decided to challenge it and, uh, and, and great for, for Vladi for the, for the uh, uh, shorthanded goal. Cause then I thought after that, it, it really ignited us. You know, finding ways to win on the road can for certain uh, breed confidence. You know, when you're looking at your record and it's really bad and if you don't win on the road, it's hard to have confidence at that point. So, you know, um, finding a way to win today is a, a big thing and we need points and um, to be able to go out and get the two on the road. And, and it is not easy going back and playing the same team again, um, you know, on a, on a kind of a back to back and not back to back nights, but back to back games and and sort of find a way to do it. I thought was real good. Vladdy's had moments, obviously, in his career playing real good hockey and, and going back to his days in Tampa. But he's he's definitely, to answer your question, yes, this is what you hoped when, when you signed him. You know, he's got great versatility. He can play in a lot of different situations. Um, and, and I do believe he can, he's one of those guys that can play up and down the lineup because his, you know, the puck doesn't die on his stick. He's really smart. He makes good plays. But yet he also is a good net front guy for not being a super big guy. And, you know, I think Vladdy's earned this opportunity. I think Vladdy's, you know, played the best of the group that wasn't really getting those opportunities. I think he's played the best. And, and you know, and I've told him that uh, at times he's earned the opportunity onto our power play, and now he's earned an opportunity on a good line. And, you know, I think Vladdy going in there uh, allows that line to continue to be successful. And that gives us, you know, two kind of scoring type lines. And, and now, you know, if we can get some grinding uh, dirty goals from the third and fourth line, all of a sudden you start building your scoring up.